Hello and welcome to a Fusion 360 quick tips and tricks videos for Fusion Cam. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do adaptive facing and this is uh, an adaptive facing strategy for basically removing a lot of material from the top of a part with an adaptive constant engagement strategy. So to get started we're going to use an adaptive clearing toolpath. We're going to go ahead and select our tool and I'm using a face mill so I'm going to go ahead and show the face mills and choose this 2 inch face mill. Going over to the geometry tab, you can leave rest machining on or off. I'm just gonna turn it off to show you that it doesn't matter. Under the heights, we're gonna change the bottom height to be model top. So that way it only machines down to the top of the model. Now we're also going to disable stock to leave under passes and you can optionally set multiple depths here if you have a lot to remove, but I'm gonna leave it at default. And linking, I'm leaving at default also because we're plunging outside the stock for this operation. So it's not gonna matter too much as far as those lead in and lead outs. And here is the finished result, the Adaptive Clearing Strategy Toolpath. It is basically a single path for this one because there's not much to remove. And it basically faces the entire part just as a face operation will. And here I'm just going to show you a quick simulation of what it looks like to show you that it is the constant engagement strategy. But we're only doing it to the model top. So as soon as we finish this, all our other operations can use model top as the top for their heights too. Thanks guys. Hope this helps.